Well, for the longest time I was thinking about like that I want to make a vlog. But then I was like, what am I, what am I going to vlog about? And then I was like, okay, you can vlog about your life. But what life? Like right now, regarding coronavirus, I, I don't have a life. I am staying at my dorms and I'm trying to paint something sometimes. I'm trying to go to paint outside because I still can. And I go grocery shopping. But that's about it. Like I don't do a lot of stuff. So let's hope that's enough. There is this piece, um, you can obviously see that I worked on it a bit more, but I liked it better without that. Um, it's work for my school, uh, I'm not really, I'm not really uh, studying art, but I'm studying art uh, with help, like a um, medium for social work, so how to put art into social work and I made this one but I made these woohoo in my uh, dorm's balcony and I stole these cushions from the common room and I already made a sketch of that tree there and I'm just gonna try to put some watercolors on there Oops. we'll see how it goes because I'm not good at making watercolors outside and also uh, nature in watercolors is really hard for me. But this is how the two beauties turn out. Uh, this is obviously the first one and this is the second one and I try to like in this one I made a lot of uh, like a very detailed sketch and then I tried to first put down the tree and then I put the background and then I tried to um, darken some of the places to put there the dimension of the tree but it didn't really work out as you can see it's really bad um, I don't really like it because the technique there is really really bad and I'm not really proud of that but I try to take it into consideration and think about it more and I made this second piece uh, which is this should be the same tree as this but I didn't sketch it out at all I just put down the first uh, I started I think I started with this layer and then I put down the, uh, the sky and then when once uh, this was dry I put this, once this was dry I put this and once this was dry I put this and then I started with the tree and I started from these lighter ones to the darker ones so, so it creates like a dimension I think it's much better than that one it's not perfect obviously but it's much better you can see me painting in the vlog is this 
a little page it's like a page from a botanical journal or something it's written in Czech language and I took the dandelion that I had that I found outside and I tried to make a study out of it make study of the flower and of the stem and also like the type of the stem and what the types or what are the par what are the parts of the plant and what type of the flower it is and blah 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 everything so it turned out like this so it's here Stelling Kunstner something I don't know so they have like a frames outside as you can see and there is like a sign that means like a welcome so we're gonna take a look inside and I couldn't really speak inside of the shop it was really weird already just filming it but it was so many beautiful stuff like I couldn't Mm, I couldn't take my eyes off them, like insanely pretty standing out, oh it was so so nice, but it's really really expensive, you see, oh you see this collection, this is Horadum Aquarel from Schminke and it's oh so beautiful, I never seen anything like that, the thing is that it's really expensive. And it's really expensive because Danish people have 25%, I don't know how it's like a tax on everything. So if they have to import something, it's really expensive. So that's why it's expensive when you can see it in the shop. And that day I was buying Posca pens and my heart cried. But um, considering ordering from here, from this shop and ordering from Amazon, it was actually much better to order from this shop than from Amazon because um, the shipping was less than before. You could see me point out on 100, it means 100 krona is 330 Czech crowns, which is approximately like 12. 12 euros um, because I didn't have enough footage I couldn't finish my talk about the taxes the thing here is that the taxes are 25% so it's really better to buy things from the people inside of the country rather than outside and to like order from Amazon it's really better and cheaper to buy from local shops so that's really good for the economics and i really like that yeah also like um i'm not danish i'm not uh, i'm not uh, from english speaking country i'm originally from czech republic and i'm here for uh, the erasm studies only for one semester so basically like right now i'm in quarantine too because we have only online classes and the virus is here like everywhere else but it's not that bad here like um it seemed by the media it looks like it's a big deal but nobody's really making a big deal out of it it's kind of cool here the people Maybe they're stupid, but they're not wearing masks because they really feel safe here. So that's a good thing. So I'm not really mad at being in Denmark. I would rather be at home making paints, but well, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna enjoy it here. I don't really care. So I think that was it. I think, it, uh, yeah, it was a lot all over the place, like lots of footage, lots of weird footage, I would say. And this old uh, treasure that I found, it's from like, it's not that I was in this stelling shop um, before one week or something, it was actually before a month, I would say, or maybe month and two weeks, so it's really old, but the rest of it is, uh, I think from last week or the 
made before it's really melting together but I'm gonna try to make another one if you wanna come and chat with me or you can leave a comment and I'll be there to respond so be sure to do that and also click that, click that subscribe button and click that bell button to show so that you know that I'm posted another video and you can follow me on Instagram or on Patreon I would be really happy to invite you there and to have you there so thank you guys for watching and see you next time bye